Dear Jasmine Dear Jasmine I wonder if this love is everlasting I promise not to treat you like your last Hi babes, hi boo boos, hi darlings Hi guys and welcome back to another video uh, uh, Another video uh, uh. By now you've already seen the bedroom makeover Bedroom decor that I've already, I already did It should be up so you've probably washed it But what you've not seen is my Ikea shopping And all the stuff that I got for the room Well technically you've seen the stuff that I got for the room But you haven't seen my experience at Ikea Ikea. so that's what this video is i just took you guys along with me to ikea to just grab um a few stuff that i needed to decorate the room um i showed you everything basically the showroom the marketplace and like ikea as a whole i hope you guys enjoy it by the way this hair that i'm wearing is from brina's hair i am gonna be linking it in my description can you tell that i've been wearing a lot of colors lately like typically i'm always wearing black but now i kind of want to switch it up what do you guys think about this color i don't know it's more like a fall color i still wanted to wear it anyway and i think it turned out cute so do check out brina's hair i'm gonna put the link in my description the link to this particular hair thank you brina's for sending me this hair okay i'm not gonna rumble on but i'm gonna roll the clip of my ikea shopping hope you guys enjoy it Welcome to Ikea guys. We're starting upstairs on the showroom floor to get some inspiration for my bedroom decor which is already up and if you haven't watched it, it's gonna be in the top right corner. I love how Ikea completely lays out tons of rooms so you can see how to actually incorporate their products into your space. I got most of my inspiration from Pinterest but then being in the showroom and looking at how Ikea had set up most of the spaces, I did get a few ideas from there as well. There are inspirations everywhere. The way Ikea is set up, you have to follow the fixed path design that guides you through the store in one direction so you're gonna see arrows on the floor pointing you to where you're supposed to be going and everybody is following it I always go all the way to the end because I love seeing the way the spaces have been set up but today we came mainly for the bedroom setups and right after that we're going to the marketplace downstairs this shop is so cute I feel like this is gonna be perfect for the office it looks nice though with the little frames. They've set everything up with the prizes. So if you see something that you like, you can't pick them from here. You have to go downstairs because that's where all the stuff are. The upstairs is just the showroom. Ah, okay, so these are the frames that I'm gonna be buying these big ones they're gonna go above the bed and I don't know if this is the mom okay so I'm buying this one too today but I'm buying um, the black one because the bed frame is black this is the exact bed frame wait hold on I don't know if this is the same bed but I'm buying this today this looks cute how do you turn it on oh I'm looking for bedside lumps as well, so maybe, but I don't like that one. I wanted to get something like this for the walkway, my little walkway, so that when guests come, they can just put their shoes in here. I haven't decided yet because my walkway is really tiny. With the mirror as well. Oh, look how big this mirror is and how cute it is. I look so cute. have this in the office and I bought my little boxes from Amazon I didn't buy it from Ikea but it fits so good still
I want to show you guys the bedrooms. I think I'm almost there. This is what I actually came to look at so I can get some inspiration and see what and what I need to buy. Okay, I definitely need some throws. I made, I added that to my IKEA list. These over here, ah, oh, yes. The colors are so nice. This one. Okay, the pillows are right ahead. Oh, they have more throws here. And these are white. And I don't know if I should do gray either. Instead of the green, maybe I'll do this one. I'm confused. This one is cheap and simple, so I don't know if I should do that one instead. But it's the same thing, it's the same type. I don't know why this one is almost $50 and this one is $14.99. I'll just hold on to these two for now. And then based on the pillowcases that I take, I'll figure out which one to take. I'm gonna take these together with the throw. I think it makes sense. I'm not really seeing anything else. Also got the pillows. I got this size 50 by 50. Pick two. I'm picking up one of these two because I'm gonna be buying a dresser today hopefully so maybe one could be for like underwear bra socks whatever I had some but they were mine was white and it looks dirty now so I think I'm just gonna go with the gray I found the white ones I feel like white would look nicer inside the dresser than the gray so I think I will do the white and I'll put back this one oh yes i bought this thing a while ago and they haven't had it in stock in forever i've just seen one so i don't know if they have it in stock yes they do so this is what i'm talking about an inexpensive shoe rack i think i'm gonna grab two so i'm just gonna add that been here for a while now and i haven't even picked everything today ikea is really really packed I'm trying so hard not to video random people because it's so packed i'm just gonna pick the stuff that i need right now i'm just buying these listings like the shoe rack for instance didn't plan on buying it and this as well but i'm gonna get those and then now i'm gonna actually focus because i have a list i made a list of the stuff that i need to pick ikea is very tempting like if you don't take care i came here for the bedroom i don't want to buy anything for any other place but here i am buying bathroom things <laughs> let's go finish this okay
I'm also hungry. I'm really hungry. Last thing before I focus on the bedroom stuff. This is probably gonna go in the powder room, but it's in this bin and I can't see the price. Hmm, ten dollars. Should I buy it? It's not bad. I think I'll just buy it. the one that I'm looking for. Oh, I found it. This is the one I'm looking for. Yep, this is the one we're getting. And it's right here. You can't give a shit out of me. Yeah. How do you know where I was going to be? Oh, this thing I didn't. I walked, walked through all of upstairs and oh. I just came around. I need a bag bag, she got light. Okay, so I'm getting two of these. I'm gonna get the bulb and then a few other stuff. Then we'll be done. Do it just nice. Okay, got the bulb for the lamps too. Looking for a particular mirror, I can't find it. It's like this one, but more rectangular. This one is also really nice, but it's really big and it's $70 for one. Doesn't make sense. And oh, got the frames as well. I grabbed two of these. So these are gonna go above the bed. This mirror is so nice. Look at this. Okay. This one. Let me show you. Put it at the corner somewhere. I think it's gonna be nice. I'm getting this one. Look at the bed, you guys. It is so full. This one is actually grass. Nice with the plants in it. I kind of like, and this one is a little too big. I think I'll do this one. I think I'll just take the green. Okay. We got the dresser. It's it's here somewhere. We also got mirrors. We got two mirrors. These are the dresses. They're really big and heavy, so they're down there. And then two mirrors that are gonna go above the bedside table. It's gonna be so cute. But this is where the big big stuff are, like big mirrors, beds couch whatever those things that are really really big they're here i think part of the reason why i'm so tired is because i'm also hungry i got some stuff there's just like a few stuff i didn't get but we're gonna have to go to another ikea to find those ones there's another one that's a um, couple minutes away from here We want to drop this one, but we already scanned it. This one, the one I'm Just that one, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Is it good? Yeah. Thank you. Have a good one. We're gonna go to another Ikea location, see if we can find the bedside tables because they didn't have it in stock here. We already checked and it's in stock at that location. So we're gonna go and just go pick it up. We made it to the second Ikea. We found them, we found the bedside tables. So that's the only thing we came for. And I think that's the only thing we were missing. Okay, back home now. This is everything that I got today. I thought I got a lot more things than this. It doesn't really look that much, but I can't wait to start putting it together. But I'm not doing that today. It's not happening today. This is going to be a tomorrow matter. Another thing that I wanted to show you guys was my package. 
from HelloFresh. This is my first time getting it. I'm excited to see how this is going to turn out. I've seen a few ads from HelloFresh. I've seen people review it. So I'm excited to try it and see if it's the real deal. I got three meals for two people because I'm going to make it for pay too. Okay, you're gonna be hearing a lot of drilling sounds because baby's working on this stuff but yeah this is how the box came it shows you the the meals that you ordered and i ordered beef and spinach rigatoni smart barbecue spice chicken i thought it looked good so we're gonna try that as well roasted salmon with crispy potatoes oh this is so cool we're gonna open the bags but it all came in bags And then they put ice together with the meat. The recipe is at the back, so you just have to follow them. Honestly, HelloFresh is kind of expensive. If not for the fact that I had a discount, I would have paid almost $100 for this. I have to put this in the fridge. I'm probably going to make one, cook one of the meals today. What's this? This is the beef and spinach all the ingredients you need <laughs> you give everything that's so cute i'm actually excited now to give it a shot service we're gonna actually try this i don't know if i'm gonna like some of the things that went in here but i'm open to trying it and giving it a chance but it looks good look at it chef jay i didn't come to play mm. it's good if i would have this meal again i would say yeah whatever it is it's very different so out of 10 mm, a seven it's pretty good I don't know about the pickles and the green beans, but the potatoes with the seasoning, I like it. This first meal was really good. Did you try the chicken with the sour cream? I'm gonna try it. It's a no for me with the sour cream. 